tayo ng mas aral Sa mas walang maiiwan At sa iyong mas aral tayo ng mas tuto Upang di kayo masenso Maging matyaga, maging matalino Hindi na mataral na tayo Matalino, halina mataral na tayo Halina mataral na tayo Halina mataral na tayo Halina, halina, halina Mataral na tayo To our educational leaders, teachers, home learning partners, viewers, and Batang Manduno, a pleasant day everyone! Welcome to Project SOAR, series of online academic reviews of Mathematics Clay Learning Module. I am Sir Johnson from Pleasant Hills Elementary School, your math buddy for today's advanced lesson in Mathematics 4, Quarter 4, Week 1. Today, we will be studying in advance about finding the area of irregular figures made up of squares and rectangles using square centimeter and square meters and finding the area of triangles, parallelogram, and trapezoids using square centimeters and square meters. Let me share with you our today's lesson objectives. First, is to find the area of irregular figures made up of square and rectangles using square centimeter and square meters. And the second one, is to find the area of triangles, parallelograms, and trapezoids using square centimeter and square meters. Let us have first a recap our previous lesson pertaining the area of a figure. How do you find the area of a square having a measure of a side 5 cm? Using the formula of finding the area of a square will give you the answer. What is the formula of area of a square? That's right! Area equals S squared, where S stands for side. Substituting the value of side, which is 5 cm, we have Area equals 5 square cm, meaning we must multiply 5 by itself twice. Area equals 5 cm times 5 cm. Therefore, the area is 25 square centimeters. Let us now proceed to our lesson. To achieve our goal, the following key concepts are needed and serve as review from the previous topic. Area can be defined as the space occupied by a flat shape or the surface of an object. The area of a figure is the number of unit squares that cover the surface of a closed figure. Area is measured in square units such as square centimeters, square feet, square inches, etc. A regular figure is a figure that is not a standard geometric shape. But some irregular figures are made up of two or more standard geometric shapes. To find the area of one of these irregular figures, we can split it into figures whose formulas we know and then add the area of the figure. Square is a regular quadrilateral which means that it has four equal sides and four equal angles. 
area equals s squared. Rectangle, a plane figure with four straight sides and four right angles, especially one with an equal adjacent side in contrast to a square. Area equals length times width. Triangle is a close two-dimensional shape with three straight sides. A triangle is also a polygon. Area equals one-half base times height. Parallelogram is a special type of quadrilateral that has equal and parallel opposite sides. Area equals base times height. Trapezoid is a flat closed shape having four straight sides with one pair of parallel sides. Area equals one half base one plus base two times height. Let us have the first problem. Jenny and Anna made a vegetable garden as shown below. Find the area of their garden. The figure shows two figures formed in a vegetable garden, a square and a rectangle. Let us find first the area of a square. The formula in finding the area of a square is a square equals s squared. Substitute the value of s which is 3 meters. Area of a square equals 3 square meters. So, 3 multiplied by itself twice is 9. Therefore, the area of a square is 9 square meters. Next is the area of a rectangle. So the formula in finding the area of a rectangle is area of a rectangle equals length times width. The length is equal to 10 meters and the width is equal to 3 meters. Substituting the values, we have area of a rectangle equals 10 meters times 3 meters. The area is 30 square meter. Combining the total area of two figures, a square equals 9 square meters plus a rectangle equals 30 square meters. Therefore, the total area of vegetable garden is 39 square meters. Let's proceed to example number 2. Find the area of a shaded region. The illustration entails two rectangles as we figure out. Rectangle number 1 and rectangle number 2. Let's find the area of the first rectangle. The formula, area of a rectangle equals length times width. So the figure has the width of 12 units and a length of 4 units. Area of a rectangle equals 4 units multiplied to 12 units. Therefore, the area of a rectangle equals 48 square units. The area of the second rectangle will be find out by using the formula again. Given width of two units but each length is not labeled. The right side of the figure is the length of the first rectangle plus the length of the second rectangle. Since the right side of the first rectangle is 4 units long, the length of the second rectangle must be 6 units. Given width of 2 units and a length of 6 units. 
area of a rectangle equals 6 units multiplied by 2 units. Therefore, the area of the second rectangle is 12 square units. Combining the area of two rectangles will give us the total area of the figure. Total area equals area of rectangle 1 plus area of rectangle 2. 48 square units plus 12 square units. Adding the two will come up to the sum of 60 square units. Is there another way to split this figure into two rectangles? Try it and make sure you get the same area. Next example is number 3. RJ has a triangular shape dot that is shown below. What is the area of the RJ slot? With a given fax, base equals 10 meters and height 7 meters. Let us find the area using the formula. Let us now substitute the values of base and height to the formula. 10 meters multiplied by 7 meters equals 70 square meters. So, 70 times 1 equals 70 and divided by 2. Therefore, the area of the triangle is 35 square meters. Next example is, Joseph bought a residential lot. The lot is in the shape of a trapezoid as shown in the illustration below. What is the area of the lot? The figure shows the trapezoidal residential lot of Joseph. Let's find out the area using the formula. Let us substitute the values of base 1, base 2, and height. Base 1 equals 7 meters plus base 2 equals 9 meters times height equals 9 meters. Area of a trapezoid equals 1 half times 16 meters times 9 meters. 144 divided by 2 equals 72 square meters. Therefore, the area of Joseph's trapezoidal lot is 72 square meters. Example number 5. A garden lot of Jerome has a base of 17 meters and a height of 8 meters. What is the total area of Jerome's garden? Jerome's garden is a parallelogram in shape. For us to find the area of a garden, let us use the formula in finding the area of parallelogram. That is area equals B or base times H or height. The given facts are base equals 17 meters and height equals 8 meters. Substituting the values, we have 17 meters times 8 meters. Let us multiply 17 and 8 for us to have a product of 136 square meters. Therefore, the area of Jerome's garden is 136 square meter. Alright kids, that ends our lessons for today. I hope you have learned something to ponder and happy learning. Thank you for watching. Again, I am Sir Johnson saying, Magsayang mag-aaral, tayo ng mag -buto.